What's up, y'all? It's Alicia Renee, and it's Vlogmas Day 14. Baby, you got come lead me through the darkness like I'm blind. You say what you don't mean, girl, I'm just trying to reach your mind. I want to make this perfect, but I know it takes some time. One thing for show is that I will never count you. Y'all, so as you can see by the title, it is self-care day one. Um... Not really day one. I'm doing a self-care like all throughout the day. But I'm going to split it up in sections so that I have content for, you know, a couple days. So for this self-care part one, I will be waxing my eyebrows. And I'm going to be using the hair removal by Sally Hansen cream removal duo kit. So I've never tried a duo kit before. But we're going to try it out today. I'm in desperate need of a self-care um, little day to myself because sis need her nails done, her toes done, her eyebrows done. But she don't want to go out and get them done professionally because COVID is in the air. So what better way and cheaper way to do it than doing it yourself? <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and get into the video. Alright, so we're going to get our, like I said, our Sally Hansen um, cream removal. And we're going to get a spoolie, a little spoolie brush to kind of like brush our eyebrows. Let me give y'all a close up my eyebrows because y'all probably like, girl. Like for one, like, I know it don't look, it probably look, don't look mine this boogie in my eye. Ew. But I don't know if y'all can tell, but my eyebrows need some uh, doings to them. I'm trying to look in the camera and still show y'all. Because I like mine to look a little bit more cleaner, more precise, more, you know. So I'm pulling my hair back. So we're going to get that. And we're going to get, um, let's see, a brush to apply it with. I don't, I don't think I have a brush. Hold on. Y'all, I got the mood set for relaxation. Like, period. Pool. Get poo. This probably got makeup on it, but I don't think it'll hurt. So let's go ahead and get it started in here. You'll also need some scissors just to kind of get them all even and stuff. So I'm gonna bring the close up mirror close to me because baby, we don't have room for mistakes at all. Meanwhile, y'all see my whole background, but it's okay. At least my room clean. So I got an eye boogie on my eyelash. So, ooh. Mm. All right. I'm going to squeeze some of this. Do you supposed to shake it? All right. Directions. Read and close directions. Caution carefully. Do not use if you suffer any medical skin conditions. Consult with a doctor. I'm not doing all that. Okay. So, quick and easy di um, direction. So, it says test a small area first. I'm not doing that. Two, gently apply cream. Wait three minutes. Remove using moist tissue and cotton ball or cotton ball so all right so i'm gonna just squeeze it i'm gonna probably do one eyebrow first so i don't mess up too bad so the eyebrow that i'm gonna do first is y'all see all that in the background but anyways the one i'm gonna do first is this one y'all i need a facial bag my face is starting to get dry again so i'm gonna put my hair off to the side y'all can't even see Okay, I'm going to pull my hairs up, brush them upwards first. And now I'm going to get my brush, my skinny little brush. So it's like a detailing brush. And I'm going to just apply that where the hair is. So draw a line. Like. Oh, it's going to be tough if I mess up. I'm trying to do it as if I was underlining my eyebrows, like with actual highlighter. All right, um, concealer. This looks good enough. And then they said make sure it's a thick layer. So 
So I'ma just fill it up. Especially with a hair's eye really. So like that. I really hope that eyebrow over there go up this high. So now we're gonna wait three minutes for the bottom one. So hurry up and set this. I'm gonna actually do it for two and two and thirty seconds. So start starting my timer and it'll go off when it's ready. Alrighty, so our timer is up. So I got me some wet um, cotton balls and I'm gonna just try to wipe off a piece. I don't know where to wipe. Oh. Do y'all see that little piece right there? It's ready. It's definitely ready. Oh y'all, I think I put too much. see this look at that so now I'm gonna get my cream again set my time go ahead and set my timer for three minutes and just apply how I did before so then I'm going to get my middle part too while I'm at it Like so. And start my timer. Timer is up. So y'all know what that means. It's time to wipe it off again. I'm going to split these into two so I have more. So I'm going to go ahead and go through the middle first. Wipe upwards. This does a really good job. I mean, it's just really burning off the hair. I don't know if y'all can see that. Eh, whatever. It's really just burning off your hairs. And then do the other side. Worse. So now, look at your girl eyebrow. Ooh, mm -mm. <laughs> so cute. Okay. So now we're going to um, brush it upwards to kind of... Um, Cut it evenly. So when I say brush it upwards, I mean go like that. I don't have much hair, but it'll do. So I get my scissors, brush it upwards, just to kind of give it that. Now, I'm gonna go in with the Extra Smooth Aftercare Lotion. This right here, the small one. And I'm gonna just put that right on top. Dot, dot, not a lot. Ooh. 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 <laughs> Hello. Okay. Put it in the middle, too, because that's where we put some at. Ooh-wee. Just go around in circles. Hold on. Yeah, I don't know where my tweezers at, but check out your girl brows compared to this one. I don't know if you, it's, it's not a big difference, but these look so good. Let me bring it close up. Ooh, ooh, compared to these. Look at these. Ooh, I gotta do a thumbnail. One minute. <laughs> All right, y'all, so now it's time for brow two. I'm gonna just go ahead and speed up the process since y'all already know what I'm doing and whatnot. So, yeah. Let's get to that part. Y'all pray for your girl. Because if it just don't turn out how this one does. I might have to cry. But anyways. But like even though this one don't look like that one at all. This is my favorite brow. This one is the tough one. So pray for your girl in the meantime. Alright, so it's the moment of truth. Okay. 
Alrighty, 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 alrighty. Alright. Just wipe. Okay. Taking. I think I, I definitely went way too high. But it's okay. It's okay. And, okay. Let's go ahead and hop into our next um, part of... Ooh, y'all. I spilled my lotion. I'm about to put this back in here. Because, baby, this calls. Y'all can get this at CVS if y'all um, ever choose to get it. CVS. So, shoot, put that lotion on my forehead. Because I put a little bit on there because I was looking at my forehead. And I was like, ooh, girl, you kind of got some um, hair up there. So, I wanted to take off a little bit, but... I ain't keep it on there long. So now that my brows are done, that I got for five dollars at um what is it called? At CVS, but I got a 40% off coupon, so it was like $7.99 or something like that. And I got it for five dollars and three cents. So you can get that for five dollars. Let's go ahead and move on to the relaxation part, is where I just soak in my bathtub. Okay, okay. So I'm going to just show y'all the bubbles. And I'm also going to put this in there. And it's the surprise inside. So I'm going to show y'all what the surprise is once we're done. Well, once it's done. This is a strawberry kiwi apple scent. So, yeah. What's up, y'all? It's Alicia Renee. And it's Vlogmas Day 15. All right, y'all. So as you can see, this is part two of... Um, my self-care day type of thing i did my nails and my toes and that's all that i really did today though so nothing much to it at all okay, so first i start off with some cuticle softener on my feet yes i actually put it on the bottom of my feet and then i let it sit for a second because usually i would soak my feet in like some listerine vinegar and hot water and epsom salt and just let it soak to help get all the dead skin off of my feet. But I didn't have any of those products today. So I'll just put cuticle softener on there. And then I also have like my foot thing. I'm not going to stay let it stay in there too long. But yeah. So yeah, I put that on my feet. I get to scraping. And then once I'm done with that, I just let so it So once I'm done with that, I go in. So once I finish scrubbing my feet and stuff like that. And all the dead skin is up. I go in and take my nail polish off. So that I can go ahead and... And put a new color I'm taking on. off my nail polish. I have gel right now. And it's literally coming up like by the toenail. So that's how you know it's desperate time to get it done. I get my um nail clipper and just clip them all the way down because I have like super long toenails. Like they're so long. They grow long, really long. So I'm gonna cut them down to size. Okay, so I'm gonna get my cuticle softener and I'm gonna just rub it across my toes and just let it sit for a second get your cuticle pusher mine's is dirty because I used on my other foot and you're just gonna go in circles like around your um, cuticle bed well your nail bed while pushing your cuticle backwards so now I'm doing my gel nails i finished my toes they don't look the best but i was rushing so that's what happens when you rush that okay y'all so i finished my nails and toes Let's see if i can get these creatures in there <sighs> nails and right. toes my toes didn't come out as expected so i'm not going to show those but um i mean that's all that's going to conclude this video it was just a little spa day for me, 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 me time. Um, you know, some self-care tips or whatever like that. But I'm about to go ahead and end this night with a I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And come back tomorrow for another video.